A man from Gainesville is behind bars tonight after a standoff with GPD's SWAT team. Investigators say he fired shots at another man, leaving him critically wounded. TV 20's at Lali Salachi tells us how witnesses are reacting to the arrest. The shooting left one man behind bars and another in the hospital. It all unfolded last night when GPD officers were called to the Woodland Park Apartments in southeast Gainesville. Nervous, scared. That's how residents felt after GPD officers arrested 39-year-old Zaki Kuhn, who they say shot a man at a Chevron gas station. The incident happened on Southeast 4th Street at around 8 o'clock last night. It's bad because everywhere you go, the grown-ups shooting and don't even care about the kids. All they want to do is shoot. Officers tell me the victim was taken to Shan's hospital shortly after being found and is currently in critical condition. I've seen my grandkids running for their life because some dumb jokers that grown ups out there shooting, acting crazy. In the park where the kids play, it built for the kids, but the grown ups take it over. Early Tuesday morning, officers identified and located Kuhn using surveillance footage from the gas station. He fled on foot and barricaded himself inside an apartment. After several hours of negotiating, he surrendered and he was taken in custody by the GPD SWAT team. Some residents tell me they were evacuated during the SWAT search. They made me nervous when he was yelling, get back in the house, get back in the house. I mean, I didn't know if he was an active shooter or, you know, what was really going on, but no, they didn't really scared. He was just nervous. Officers tell me Kuhn was taken into custody at around 1 p.m. And GPD is investigating other people who may have been involved in the shooting. Live in the studios at Lali Solache, TV 20 News.